Thank you. He wants you, Miss Evans. He's chosen you if you'll have him. A young woman who's fleeing a bad relationship and trying to get as far away from this as possible, she ends up on the other side of the world, really, um, in England to take a nanny job um, at a remote estate. And um, when she meets the family, it's uh, the couple's older and they're a bit strange and eccentric. And they have a lot of rules for their eight-year-old son because they've never left him alone. And when she meets the kid, though, uh, he's not a boy at all. He's a, he's a late-year-old life-size porcelain doll, um, or a life-size eight-year-old porcelain doll. It was, it was really fun to kind of like hone in on what the family would have wanted to create. And really, the, the idea was they want to create something as close to their son, but perfect as possible. And um, so it was going to be a romanticized version of their son to some degree. But we didn't want him to be particularly scary in, in anything that he was doing, just scary because he wasn't doing anything and because he's so stoic and he's a, such a great actor because he, he never screws up. I mean, I think coming into the movie, obviously the audiences will know what it's about, but it's still a nice twist in those first five minutes to reveal that, okay, you know, the boy you're going to be taking care of is, is, a, is, a, is a doll and, um, and this family's crazy and they're going to leave her there with the doll, which is not uh, was clear when she gets there. So, so it makes, you know, it's like you, can, you really feel like, okay, now we're on a ride. You know, it's, I don't quite know what to expect. 